Hey, it's Kevin. Welcome to my Road Warrior video blog. This week, it's kind of an auto topic, but, well, it was actually, uh, well, it wasn't an auto topic that touched on it, but the other day I was talking with my wife, a couple weeks ago maybe even, I don't remember what day it was, and I mentioned, uh, we were talking about something that I just said, well, 1714 done. She goes, what the hell is 1714 done? So that was my address when I was in, like, kindergarten, first grade in Cheyenne, Wyoming. She's like, how do you remember what your address was in first grade? Like, I don't know. I just remember, and we only lived there a couple of years. Now, I remember my first address in Quincy when we moved to Quincy when I was eight, because I lived there for, you know, almost eight years. It was, you know, 1824 Jersey. But then we moved, and we were in a, uh, you know, condo complex, and I don't remember. It was Country Club Heights. That's all I remember of that. And I'll be honest with you. I've moved so many places, I, I can't remember addresses. I know my Ohio address still. I mean, I've got to know that one. I know my Tennessee address. But beyond that, I'll be honest with you, I, I guess maybe because I lived in apartments for so many years. But another thing with that is is license plates. When I was first driving, not my first driver's license, because I had a specialized plate on my Volkswagen. I had the license plate in Illinois Kev 70, KEV 70 that we got. Um, it's not exactly what I wanted, but I took it and was happy with it. But when I moved to Virginia when I was 17, actually I was 16 when I moved there, but you know, going on 17, um, we couldn't get personalized license plates. And I like personalized license plates. I thought they were cool at the time. So we were just forced to take whatever was the next in line at the, at the BMV or DMV or whatever Virginia called their Motor Vehicle Bureau. And so my father's car had the license plate NDB925 and my Volkswagen had NDB926. Now, how I remember those numbers to this day, I couldn't tell you. What's funny is, is I don't have a personalized plate here on the Ford Explorer. I couldn't even tell you. I, I, I have no clue what the number is on this car. I know my old Ohio plate uh, on the Explorer well, it started with BK, and I always remember that because of Burger King. But I couldn't tell you the numbers. If it had three numbers, four numbers, six numbers, I don't even remember anymore. Plates are somewhere around the house. My Mini Cooper, I've got personalized plates on that, so they're no problem to remember. But numbers, are just as I've gotten older, are just so tough. And there are just some numbers you can remember. You know, in, in Ohio, when I was in radio, when we moved into our new building, so I worked in the new building like six, seven years, we had a door code. We didn't have keys. We had door codes. So I could remember my door code which I bet if I went up there this day, they probably haven't taken it out yet. I probably, if, if anybody's watching up there, they'll go change it now. But I get in the building really if I wanted to, not that I would ever do that, that's just how I'm wired. But what's amazing is, is there are just some numbers you can remember. I can remember some phone numbers, but there are other numbers I can't remember. I mean, I had the same phone number for, you know, eight, 10 years, and I couldn't remember it. I don't know why some numbers stick and why some numbers don't. I think sometimes some of the older numbers, some of those things we remember as kids, tend to be the things we remember most. Well, I'll tell you what, traffic's a little heavy today. I better get, you know, concentrating on the road and stop dealing with numbers. The only number I need to be worrying about is my speed limit, which is right on 55 right now, and we're good to go. Another Road Warrior video blog, we'll do that next week. KevinMason.us, that's where the Road Warrior videos sit. All 70 or 80 or I don't even remember, I, I don't keep track of the numbers. I number them just for sheer number's sake, but couldn't tell you how many we're up to now. Um, I lose track after a while. I just got to have it written down in the number pad and I keep a tally of it. But you can always find us on YouTube too. My username there, Kevin Mason. You can also subscribe on YouTube. They go simultaneously on YouTube and the website at the same time. So, I, I, you know what? I would love for you to come to the website, but if you want to watch them on YouTube, that's fine too. If you just want to load them up and subscribe there, I'd love for you to do that. That's my main page. It's not a dedicated Road Warrior video page. I'd actually thought about that but avoided that and just put them on the website because that was just too much time re-uploading and repositioning and repurposing and losing play counts. And See you next week.